And the Wildcats have just landed at Perth Airport and Lockie Reid is there to greet them. Now, Lockie, it's been a long day flying back from the Gold Coast for the boys, but I'm sure they're still beaming. Yes, Tim. Well, it's been seven hours on the plane for the Perth Wildcats. And to steal your words from earlier today, they have booked themselves a spot in the NBL Grand Final Series. Uh, Kevin Lish, the star, the hero, the, the absolute superstar of the Perth Wildcats, joins me now. And, Kev, uh, you're becoming an icon here in WA. Well done on uh, last night's performance. Thanks a lot. It was a lot of fun. And uh, just glad we could uh, stick together till the end. Take us through the, the dying moments. You hit a couple of very important baskets. Uh, what were your emotions? And did you ever? think you were going to actually get back into this game yeah w for a while we were struggling there but uh luckily when it counted we uh we kept our poise uh you know stayed composed and uh when it mattered we we hit some big shots and came out on top now in television games you have been dominating in other games you know you just don't put up any performance at all uh what is it about tv games <laughs> well i don't know if there's any correlation there but uh you know i i, I do like taking big shots but uh um, you know, maybe that's just the uh, perception from the media now. You've played a lot of basketball in your career. Now, uh, you haven't played in a grand final series at high school, college, or obviously in your professional career. Yeah, I'm really looking forward to this. This is kind of a, a new chapter in my life right now. And, uh, you know, you can kind of feel the buzz in the air here at, in, in Perth and, and around the country. And, uh, you know, it, it's going to be a lot of fun. Beautiful stuff. Uh, stay with us just for a moment because the coach of the Perth Wildcats also joins me. And uh, do you love him right now, Kevin Lish? I think everybody loves D Lish. <laughs> yeah, yeah, men, women, everybody loves him. <laughs> <laughs> what did you make of that final term? And did you really, seriously, as a coach, give yourself a chance of winning? There, there's no question. Oh, there's enormous belief in our, our guys. And we, we, we were down and out. And it was a question of, we've got nothing to lose. Let's go down fighting. Let's play the Wildcat style of game and play pressure defence, take open shots. And that, that's what we did and we've done it in the past and uh, you know, a little bit of doubt but at the same time uh, you know, with a lot of faith in our guys to get it done. It's been magnificent by you of course so we spoke to you last week and you were out of a job last year you're now a coach in the NBL grand final series how are your emotions? Uh, last night it was, it was you know, excited it really was just exciting that uh, you know 12 months ago out of a job now uh, with one of the, the premier clubs and uh, first year in the league in a grand final, it's uh, in Perth, fantastic. Who do you think you'll play quickly? Uh, I think we'll, it'll be Wollongong, but uh, I think Townsville will get tonight and I think Wollongong will get them at home and we'll play them next week. Rob, thanks very much for joining us. Kevin, thank you very much for joining us. Uh, the beauty and the beast. Um, well, I think it's that way, Tim, but anyway, back to you. Good on you, Lockie. Lockie, and thanks to uh, Rob and also Kevin for staying back.